on start and type disk. Now press disk cleanup option and just wait for this cleanup opening. After opening of this cleanup, you have to clean any file you want from the disk. So most people hit on recycle bin, temporary files. You can choose any of them. After choosing, here is an option rescan. So just click on rescan and that goes to rescan. So just wait for that. After rescanning, you are able to clean disk. This process may take time, so just wait here. Okay, after rescanning, now you are able to clean your disk. Just choose a particular file like window defender, temporary file. You can also check their sizes. Um, it's take 12 GB. Okay, so I scroll so you can see all the options. So just click on their dialog box. Select your particular disk file. After this, you have to click on OK button and for the permanent delete option, click delete. Okay, here we done. Thank you guys for watching. This video show you how to update driver for your PC. First of all right click on my computer and choose the property option. Once if a new window pops up click on device manager tab. Now select the driver you want to update one by one. Right click on driver you wish to update and click on property option. When a new window appears, click on driver and choose the update driver option. On the next window, you will be displayed with two new options. The first option is search automatically option. And the other option is browse my computer option. In this option, you can use CD, DVD, etc. For this video, we would be choosing automatic searching option. Repeat the same option for the each updation. For installing window operating system, click on start and go to the restart option. Now this machine has set to boot from the DVD. When you're gonna start now, you should press any key here. Now this device hand over to the disk. Again when we start it. Actually this process will take more than one and a half hour so we only show you the important parts. Okay now choose the language. Choose the any custom language like English UK. Click on next. Here another alternative option for the window like repair your computer or installing window so we just stall now so click on install now option now window setup is started okay then click on I accept the license term uh, if you want to read this term so you can after it 
click on next now choose the alternative options I'm choosing custom one okay here's the important part so alternative disk driver options you can select here if you want to format them when you install your new window so click on device drive option options will be like delete format refresh so whatever disk you select click on format then disk will format with your installation so okay I'm click on format option now okay click on ok option this process will take some time okay click on next and installing window is started okay now window is started again again I'm telling you this process will take more than one and a half hours so we skip the steps is. so I'm just show you the important parts now window setup is started registry settings for the registry setting you will wait again press any key for booting now windows will start it again okay type your username type your PC username and click on next I'm um, typing mine Uh, just click on next type your password or we can skip this step now type your predict key this is step we will skip again okay so choose your alternative options like I'm choosing the recommended settings click on use recommended settings now choose the correct time and date you can change your date here click on next now choose your local home network if you have a Wi-Fi, so you can change the setting to now type the password click on skip if you want okay now window is finishing your setting preparing for your new window okay here we done thank you guys for watching